Hello everyone, this is Sashmit from Pragai Technologies. This is the second video in series for upgrading the Navision 2009 R2 database to 2016 version. So let's start. Here we have the 2016 version of Navision. So let's start by quickly uploading the partner license into the database. Open the 2016 version and import the partner license that, that is used for any customized objects for your database. So for importing the license, we can use the tools and license option and import the license that is the 2016 license that we have. Next we can open the 2013 converted database in the 2016 development environment directly. Similarly as we did for 2009 to 2013 version. The system will start converting the database followed by the upgrading the objects. Once the database conversion is complete, system will require the synchronization of objects such as tables to validate the schema changes. For this we will need to create an instance for Navision 2016. As you can see here that database is checking for the application objects. Next we will convert the objects and in the third process the database that is the 2016 will upgrade the objects to make it compatible with the 2016 version. So here you can see that the database is now upgrading the objects that is the table objects followed by all the objects that comes with the 2016. Now the database is successfully converted. Now you can see here that database will require the synchronization of all objects. So the synchronization can be done using the tools. When we click on tools, we can see that sync schema for all tables comes here. So when we click OK, so system prompts that we need to have an instance for 2016 version. So we can create the instance of 2016 version from the administration tool. We have to run this administration tool as an administrator and we can create the instance from there. Now the Navision 2016 version that is the standard version have the new functionalities such as workflow functionality that comes as a new functionality in Navion 2016. So we need to export this functionality from standard version and import this functionality in the version that we just converted. So we can export all the workflow objects in an FOB file and import it in our newly converted database. Save it as workflow 2016 in FOB format. Now it's exported. Now next we can import this in 2016 version. We, we also have a report inbox functionality in Navion 2016. So we also export these objects in a FOV file and we'll import those in our newly converted database. So I just quickly export the objects for the report inbox. I mark those objects and export them. Here, here are my objects, so I export them as report inbox. Now I can go to the demo 2009 database that is my newly converted database from 2013 to 2016 version now. I can import the workflow objects and the report inbox, inbox objects here. and I can choose the synchronization as later because I have not created an instance yet. If we have created an instance then we can use the with validation or force button here. Now my objects are imported. I can see the objects here now and I can compile those objects to check any compilation errors. 
when i compile these objects you can see that there are many errors that comes here so for example a code unit 1530 is required that does not exist in this version in this database so i can export this 1530 code unit from the standard version of 2016 and import it directly in my newly converted database export this and import it in our new database when I import this and compile the objects again for workflow then you will see that the 1513 code unit error will be removed now similarly all the errors can be removed by exporting and importing the objects or by comparing the objects in a text format and merging them after removing all the errors we can start the navigation application and we can see that the workflow functionality will be running in our new database that is the newly converted database When you go in Navigation, you can type workflow here and you will see that the workflow objects are now available in Navigation 2016. This is how we can upgrade the database manually in Navigation from 2009 to 2016 version. Thanks for watching this video. For more information, please visit www.paraguide.com.